you're going to need your hobby knife and you're going to need some of these pins and you should have already cut all of your pieces out so I'm going to take this one pattern this is for our wings and what you want to do is make sure that the grain of the wood aligns with your wing design so I'm going to set my pattern on here I can put this right to the edge now I want the grain to be perpendicular to the wing so I don't want it to be at an angle or anything like that I want to make sure that this wood grain goes straight across <coughs> the entire wing okay and then I'm going to pin it down so I'll take these pins don't put them too close to the edge because you're going to need to work around the edge when you're cutting it out all right so I'll put my pins in okay so now my little piece of balsa wood and my pattern shouldn't move around. Take my hobby knife. Be very careful with this guy. This wood is very thin. It will not take a lot of pressure to cut. Um, but remember, it's important to be super exact. The closer you follow your pattern and the more exact you are, the better your plane is going to fly. And small variations can make a big difference in how, how far it flies and how long it stays in the air. So I'm going to go ahead and follow this line. I'm going to do it kind of lightly at first. I don't, I don't need to cut all the way through the balsa wood in the first pass. Okay, so I'm just following this line. You can use a ruler to do this as well, but if you have a steady hand, I found that it was just easier to follow the line and just to trace it. But if it's easier for you to make a straight line by using a ruler, then you can do that as well. So I continue just holding this pattern in place. When you go against the grain, it's a little bit harder. You'll notice a big difference when you're cutting against the grain. So take your time on it. Go over it a couple of different times. And again, you don't have to get all the way through the balsa wood in the first try. So, yeah, go ahead. All right, so... All right. At any rate, you'll we'll we'll go ahead and demonstrate that. You would just keep cutting it out, and like I said, take your time, and then you have one long wing piece. You'll do that and cut all of your pieces out. So, cut your vertical stabilizer, your horizontal stabilizer, and your fuselage. Especially your fuselage is much thicker, but you are cutting uh, with the grain basically. So it will cut pretty easily, but same thing. You just put your pattern on and then pin your pattern in place and pin your balsa wood in place, and that's all you need to do to cut your pieces out.